Hi everybody, Lynn here out at the Isle of Wight Pearl at the Bryston Christmas Tree Festival, the 21st Christmas Tree Festival. I was trying to live stream but the signal is very bad so I'm going to do video. So here this tree is the, uh, the lace makers of the white and as you will expect there's some really delicate and beautiful lace ornaments on this tree. It's very beautifully done it is too. Okay, so this is out at, Bryce, at the Isle of Wight Pearl as part of the Bryston Christmas Tree Festival. Then we have the Ancient Order of Foresters called 1821. They wish you a happy, a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. There's dates of their meetings on the tree and a very beautiful gold and red tree it is too. There we go. And so now we come on to the Pet Doctor's Tree. Pet Doctor's here and lots of, as you would imagine, a lot of pets on this tree, a lot of paw prints as well. And there we go, all the way up. And, oh, I think that's a nice hedgehog on the top. And down the bottom, there are leaflets to pick up and take away with some more information. Then we have the British Divers Marine Life Rescue. And it says, we need volunteers. Are you interested in helping marine mammals? And then on here, there are all sorts of marine mammals. So lots of, and some more information on their tree. And next we have my friend Joe's tree. Joe runs a business called Making a Dream. And um, she can transform your venue into the perfect, um, perfect party, perfect wedding venue, whatever. Um, you just discuss your ideas with Jo and she can turn them into make your dreams a reality um, and there we are beautiful tree there and she's got leaflets down there to collect as well she is part of all things networking and this is the all things networking tree this is my tree or our tree we are a networking group we help um, businesses um, to raise their visibility so there we are all things networking and you will see all sorts of people's business cards here to take away um, and then we have different members this is nathan's um he runs a garden for you then on this one we have sandra she she runs she runs um she she's brought the crystal heart therapy to the isle of wight and um, there's squeaky clean that's jason who can clean your windows your ovens etc Zetam, they are brilliant um, they did our banners there's a, a little that's a photograph of the banner they did that that was a huge banner and i shrunk it down as a photograph and um, they helped us out when we were stuck on that over here there's helen's card helen runs over dean chase um, cottages over in Ryde, in the Upton area of Ryde, beautiful cottages. And then next to her is Bank Cottage. Tina and Terry run Bank Cottage in Newport. Over on the next one we have Jane Mott, who is um, a makeup and hair, hair, um, she does makeup and hair and she does mine, I can recommend her highly. Above that it's the Stitching Elmers, which is a beautiful um, craft shop in the top of the High Street in Ryde. And underneath that, that's Yasmin's, um, Yasmin does handicraft and does some beautiful crochet work. Then we have Making a Dream, which actually is from Joe's tree there. And then here is my nail technician. Let me show you, my, oh, can I get my beautiful nails in too? There we are. And um, that's Laura Polish Me Pretty. And then we have a biscuit here. I wonder if it'll still be here at the end of the exhibition. A beautiful snowflake hand iced biscuit by um, Nicola of Be Little Betty's Bakes. And I know she's busy making about 3,000 biscuits at the moment to complete an order for somebody for a corporate order. Iomi Gold, that's um, es uh, Estelle. If you want, if you worry about making speeches, Estelle is the person to see. All the details are here on the tree. Next to that we have White Life Images. That's Mo, who, who's a hobby photographer, but now starting to turn her photography through working with the network. She's turning her photography into a business now, which is fantastic that we've been able to help her with that. There's Mark's um, keyring, your stationery, all your stationery needs from Mark, and he's got business cards over on the table. Um, down here we have Karen's card, Realms of Serenity. And then here we have Annette Gregory. She 
um, is my accountant and a beautiful glittery pound sign there. Then we have um, White Fit, which is Tory, runs White Fit down and the business New Newport Business Park. And then on this one, we have my card, Lynn. Yeah, that's me, they call me the Connection Queen because I help to connect all these businesses. Then we have Heather, who's an independent private midwife. We have Dawn Graham, um, who's brought EFT and Matrix um, re-imprinting um, to the island. And you need to know more about that, then you need to connect with her. Kids, um, Play Cafe Baby Chino, that's Rebecca. There's Kiva's um, Cafe, up, a beautiful cafe up in um, Ride High Street. Dragonfly Beautiful Shop in Newport. Um, up here, we have, um, that is a beautiful, unique box, as in unique, the beauty products. And look at the beautiful, um, can you see, don't know if you can see that. Oh, sorry, a bag. I think it's a bag charm and it's got lipstick and beautiful lips and that is um, Juliet, one of our members so there we are there's the little snowman watching over it all um, have I done them all I don't know if I've done them all let's see if I've, I hope I haven't missed any out because this is our tree and I need to so over here we've networking opportunities exist everywhere networking in Kivas networking at Super Bowl networking at the Dorset networking at Dragonfly networking in iHeart buttons and there's all the details for us find us on Instagram call me on that number find us on Twitter and Facebook and over here there's some leaflets and if you want to know more about um, networking or how we can help you if you run a business or a charity or host events and want more visibility then please come and check us out I also do lots of live streaming. Unfortunately, this one I had to do video because the signal was bad, but I do live stream lots of events over on isleofwhite.live. And here we have West White Pool League, and their little pool set there. And on the, t on, on the tree, you have lots of pool balls and a little pool set right up the top made into a Christmas tree. And then, here we have the British Lung Foundation and Breathe Easy Isle of Wight. So let's go up the tree. Lots and lots of beautiful things here. All sorts, and then they've used the backspace for their bunting as well. And then we have Morrison's Supermarket in Newport who are supporting Young Lives Versus Cancer and the Click Sergeant charity. And they have got some leaflets there to pick up. And there we are, that's their beautiful tree. And then next to that, let's have a look. This is a Siberian fair trade tree, and this is something new that's come to the island. Um, we are an Isle of Wight social enterprise owned by local charity Communi Community Action Isle of Wight to have a wide range of beautiful items available for sale at God's Hill Village shop. Riverside and Scouts Lane Bakery. So do have a look at them, um, a fair trade business. And there we are, look, there's some beautiful ornaments on their tree. And then, whoops, there's a little, a little man's fallen on, a little gingerbread man's fallen off there, the Bats Wing Tea Rooms. So there you are, lots of teacups and lots of gingerbread men, gingerbread men soaring. I hope they don't saw the branches off. There's some rather interesting looking biscuits. I hope they still remain and don't disappear through the, um, through the festival with little fingers coming by, but I'm sure they'll be fine. And then here we have Red Funnel, our Red, one of our ferry companies. And there we go. And as you might expect, um, a ferry, surprisingly enough, made out of Lego various Lego items. Looks like the staff have had quite a fun time and, and one of the members of staff obviously posing there too. Over here we have Cowborn Watermill. Very interesting looking tree, very, very imaginative. Lots and lots of goodies on here, all sorts. There's a um, multi-grain muesli mix, blissful berry muesli, all sorts of different items that you can, put, I'm presuming that you can buy over at the watermill and it's well worth a visit and then we have vexed his 40s vintage and 
This is lovely. They've got some flickering candles, but of course they aren't real candles because of fire regulations. So they've, um, they've got uh, um, imitation candles there, which is beautiful. Lots of lovely things on that tree. Freshwater independent lifeboats here. And this is a very interesting looking tree. Uh, you know, rather unusual, not, to, not quite the same, but it's just nice to see the talent and the variety that has gone into these. And there's a, there's the fireman actually he's turning his back on me how very rude while i'm videoing but never mind he's move he's he's moving around as i'm um, as i'm videoing so there we are we are funded totally by you the community so we we, we do live on an island we do rely on um, contributions obviously so it's very important that um people do contribute so hopefully people will um keep contributing to them the whole of the um the there he is, he's coming round this way now, thank you. Um, the whole of the festival is raising funds for lots and lots of charities. Now this one is Lizzie's Way, and let's see what it says. Cre Lizzie's Way is creative adventures inspired by nature, powered by play. So come have a, have a look and see what that one's all about. Some very beautiful and bright garlands decorating that tree. There we go. And then in here, in the corner, we have the Arts Society Isle of Wight at, at Key Arts. So there we are, lots of information on their tree. It's very nice, a nice tree too. Lots of beautiful trees. And this one is the Isle of Wight Prostate Cancer Support Group. And lots and lots of little blue gingerbread men, it looks like on here. So there we go. The little men, actually. No, I don't know that they're gingerbread. They're, they're the little men, obviously, to do with prostate cancer. Um, so there we are. That the little men on the tree represent the 274 men who diagnosed with prostate cancer on the island in the past year. The varying colours of the little men represent the different emotions, treatment and outcomes experienced by men with prostate cancer. So obviously, you know, there's a pot, pot there to put your donations in. Um, so the more donations, the more they can fight this. And Health Watch Isle of Wight. House Watch in the Caledonian Society. So here we are, look, have your say, your voice counts. Lots and lots of messages on this tree. There we go. And then we have John's Club. And John's Club, let's bring that forward a bit. An Isle of Wight charity that supports people with disabilities in the community. And they, work, they support teenagers and adults with special needs. There we go, and they do a grand job too. So there we are. Interesting to see so many different trees decorated in so many different ways. Co cooperative funeral care family support. So here we are, there's some messages on the tree. And I think some of these messages have been written. Um, I won't go in close, but they're personal messages that have been written by obviously family members who've lost family members and that's they obviously support them well there then we have taj crafts here we go there we go lots and lots of beautiful craft items little little snow men ladies little stockings cross stitches uh, beautiful beautiful work there and then we have age uk freshwater memory and active network club there we go and that's a very beautiful tree all sorts of different trees just really really beautiful and then we have medina house school and Medina House um, supports children. It says, this tree was decorated by Medina House School. All of the children made a decoration based on our school topic, worldly celebrations. So there we are. And they support um, children with learning difficulties. And a good job they do too. And then we have the YMCA Young Carers um, Group and another beautiful tree lots and lots of peg dolls peg decorations on this one that's lovely and there we are there's some some people on in the pictures some of the work that they're doing 
there let's have a little look some of the activities they get up to obviously and then we have sporting bears and sporting bears motor club driving for charity and there are a lot of pictures of um, cars surprisingly you know or not surprisingly should I say and then we have West White Time Bank and um, lots and lots of hands here with messages on them we could all share our talents a gardener must be with up with the lark and go to bed with the robin on the allotment helping playing one member gave me a haircut so lots of different so spare time is shared time and i'm going to take one of these leaflets so that i can learn more about it and then over here we have oops the monday prayer group there we go and lots of prayers on there lots of cards i don't know if they've got things on the back no they've got pictures on um, obviously representing prayer a new commandment a new commandment i give unto you that you love one another as i have loved you that you love one another as i have loved you and um, that's the part of the mission prayer for the monday prayer group and here we have friends of Booberry, I hope that's how you pronounce it. And this is providing accessible, good quality and sustainable health care in the community of Booberry in rural western Kenya. And there we are, they've got a very orangey bronze colour theme for their tree. And then over here we have Bryston Health Walking Club. Okay, so and this is in memory of a dear friend Anne, a lovely lady who enjoyed walking with their group. And then they've got lots of hearts and beautiful decorations there. So I'm just going to, just, and I spy somebody on his lunch break. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> and you are? Yeah, he's, he's the manager here of the Isle of Wight Cafe, just taking a sneaky peek out to have a look at all these beautiful trees. What do you think of them? Oh, they're brilliant. Aren't they marvellous? Absolutely. I was trying to live stream, but the live stream dropped out, so I'm videoing instead. <laughs> Very many inspired ideas, yes. But you know there's 200 trees across Bryston altogether, over 200 trees. So I started at the Isle of Wight Pole because mine's in here. <laughs> so, thank you over 200 all oh, right oh i started in here have you so have you enjoyed it right okay <laughs> well i've only got this far so far i've got to go and do the rest yes <laughs> i know I, I i did it for the first time last year and um, I live streamed it all, you know, yeah. and so that other people could see if they couldn't get here. Yes. It's getting bigger and bigger. <laughs> They're going to have to put marquees up soon to put. Four years. No, just because you haven't. No, same as me. So do I. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You're glad, yes. I know, I know. It was raining when I left home. <laughs> Good. Well, I, should, I must carry on. Thank you. Oh, in, oh, right. Oh, no. <laughs> so here's the cafe, and lots of people can have have their um, stop and have a meal or a cup of coffee. So I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> scones in the Wilberforce Hall. Scones in the Wilberforce Hall. Right. Okay. Yeah, and I know there was mulled wine somewhere. Oh, so might be. Oh, right. might be oh, I might be coming back at the weekend. All <laughs> oh, right. Thank you so much. Thank you. That's it. Oh, now you have. <laughs> Hans and um, and Isle of Wight Air Ambulance here. There we go. 
and um, it, some little helicopters on this one. Somebody sat and made all of these, and then somebody else suggested that they should make some to sell, so maybe next year they might do that. Look, Lila Lee was getting in the picture. She's helped me um, transport all my goodies today. I did get a lift on, when, on Monday, and then today I've come over um, on my own on the bus, and that was very challenging. So, um, right, this is the Inglefield nurse, Nursing and Residential Home and um, very beautiful decorations on this tree some pom-poms a little a little robin there we do like robins some pom pommy decorations all sorts a little cheeky elf there and then here we have king's textiles and they print t-shirts so on their tree they've got lots of little t-shirts with messages on and they are part of, um, they are also connected with Personalise, which is next door, which does a lot of personalised goods for you. And then we have Tatnall Farm in this little corner. And they've got some wonderful baubles on their tree. And let's home in a bit. So let's see. They've uh, got all sorts of... Oh, there's some food. Wait a minute, can I get it? There's some food because you can eat it at the farm. As you would expect, there's some animals there. Some drink, having a drink. Um, I think I saw some accommodation. I'm not sure. Um, it's, a bit, it's reflecting a bit on, the, on those. So lots and lots. Oh, some activities for the children. So that is, Tatnall Farm is one of our um, attractions and accommodation providers here on the Isle of Wight. And here we have, let's see, Breakout Youth. And this is, um, are you the parent or carer of a child aged between seven and 11 years old with connection to the LGBTQ plus community? And so that's supporters there and very beautiful rainbow colors there. And then we have lots of tennis balls on this tree and this one is supporting the West White Sports Centre. Here we go. That's very beautiful too. Oh and the, look the star is made out of shuttlecocks. How clever. Some very talented people around here. And then we have the Isle of Wight Motor Caravans Club and earlier on there were some children here who had taken out the little characters in the caravan and they were playing with them here there's there's a little family living in that caravan down there and the children were having a wonderful time sitting here playing with it and there we are we have lots of lots of blue pom-poms on this one and a nice knitted oh it's a looks like a, sna a snail i think on the top there we go and then we have NHS Mental Health Reablement re Service and GYLA Group. There we go. So all of these, if you want to know more of these, you need to come down to the Isle of Wight Pearl before the end of the weekend. It's now the 7th of December 2017. And this, oh, the Pearl, actually, some of these trees will be uh, still, uh, still on, uh, still up um, until New Year. Um, the rest of the trees are coming down, but in the pearl they can stay up. This is the West White Alpacas. There we go, so lots of little alpacas on their tree. Some, some alpaca wool in the branches too. There we go. And then next to that we have the Vectis Core of Drums. And they wear white gloves when they're drumming. So um, there we are, hence lots of white gloves, lots of, lots of notes on this tree and um, a board there with lots of their activities as well so that's beautiful then i'm just going to swing round the other side and over here we've got spence willard who are um, estate state agents on the island there we go so they've got lots of their little ha lots of little houses in fact they've got houses that are lights that was a clever one and then they've got um, their boards, you know, like they're for sale boards or sold boards or sale agreed, actually, it's saying mostly. There we go. And then over here, we have Isle of Wight Beach Cleaning Volunteers. Oh my goodness, and this is a, a very beautiful tree. 
Facebook. The sun is actually shining in. I mustn't complain, but it's making it difficult to video. So look, lots of the rubbish that they pick up off the, off the beach. That's rather beautiful. And then this one is the Needle National, National Coast Watch Institution here. And this is just in the, in the seating area just watching looking out I'm gonna I don't know if you can see the sun's very very bright so I have to keep it down so this is a beautiful view from the Isle of Wight Pearl and then I've just got a couple more trees down the bottom to show you so we go down here we are walking through Isle of Wight Pearl now there's a beautiful they've got some beautiful trees of their own here across there And then so all this beautiful jewellery here that you can have a look at while you're here at the Pearl. And then over here we have Chessel Woodyard Limited's tree. There we go. And as you would expect, very beautifully carved out of wood. There we go. And then the Isle of Wight College Pathways Programme. And this, oops, got caught on my trolley. This is representing the Blue Planet. So there we are, lots and lots of different items there. It's beautiful. And then here, the Isle of Wight fostering team. Lots of information about fostering here. And a very beautiful pink tree. And some, beauty, some lovely ladies in the design workshop looking at me and giving me a smile. Give me a wave. You're on camera. <laughs> busy, are you? Yeah, yes. What are you doing? What are you making? Right. Oh, so nobody else would have a matching piece. No, these are all all one offs. Wow, that's beautiful, yeah. isn't it? So. Uh, so, are you expecting a busy weekend? Yes, yes. But with the tree festival, yes, that's yes. That's what I meant. You know, this yeah, weekend, absolutely. yes. Yeah. And um, I've started yes, here because my tree's over in in here. Uh, so, <laughs> which is all things networking. Oh, We're a networking okay. group who help yeah. help other businesses yeah. to connect oh, and whatever. Right. So, um, yes. Yeah, so my tree's in the corner, and I came here first because I still got bits to put. I put yeah. a little table by it with some yeah. stuff on. <laughs> Thank you very much, ladies. Keep. I won't hold you up any longer. <laughs> Have a, have a happy afternoon. <laughs> and to you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. And then here, a beautiful tree in the entrance to the Isle of Wight Pearl. And um, oh, more trees, lots of trees here. It's beautiful. And then news of the park and ride shuttle bus. And I, so I'm just going to leave you now, folks. And I'm going to record again when I get to the other parts of... Um, of um, Bryston, but I'm just going to go out and get the shuttle bus back back to Bryston and look at look at the lovely car that the Isle of Wight Pearl have here. So and look at the beautiful scenery.